Hey everybody, welcome back to another CAD tutorial on Fusion 360. In today's video, we are going to model bearing block. Uh, as you can see in the CAD drawing, we have uh, a bearing block which is of length 1.5 from the center of two holes and the radius of the arc on the either end is 0.375. The height from the center of the hole to the bottom of the block is 0.437 and the radius is again 0.375 for the top semicircle. So let us go back to fusion click on create sketch and let us go to create and draw a center rectangle on the bottom plane. Uh, once we are done with drawing center rectangle give the length from two circle centers which is 1.15 and now I'm going to draw arc on the both ends which is of distance 0 0.75 uh, 0 0.375 times 2 which is again 0.75 once you are done with that i'm going to make these two lines as a center lines hit x on your keyboard to make it center line now as you can see this semicircle is already tangent but the other semicircle is not tangent with the rectangle so i'm going to select the semicircle click the tangent the constraint from the dialog box and select the rectangle our sketch is completely black and now let us draw two circles which are of equal size so two circles in the center and I'm going to use equal constraint and select two circles now if I give size to one circle the other circle will be of the same size by default so the size is 0.188 as per our cat drawing once you are done with giving the size exit the sketch click on finish sketch isometric view home button and give the extrude command and the total height of the base is 0.148 once you are done with the base let us draw a sketch on the front face of the base let us start with a center line from the origin again hit x on your keyboard to make it as a construction line now draw a circle make it coincident to the center line once you are done with that now we are going to
model is completed i hope you guys learned something new today if you did make sure to click like on on this video and share it with your friends whoever in, is in need thank you so much for watching see you guys next time